D-Day arrived, and Tiet, Mark and I were excited to be on our way, despite the cold Cape Town wintry weather. The goal for the day was to hug the coast and fly north as far as possible. Our first refueling stop was planned for a farm strip next to the Berg River, 85 miles to the north of Cape Town. After refueling and a quick leg stretch, we got underway. Amazingly, the clouds completely disappeared and our headwind turned into a favorable tailwind with brilliantly smooth flying weather. The Namibian border seemed to be within the day's reach. On landing in Lammas Bay, Tiet told me he had left his passport behind in the hangar that morning. We decided to route through to Friedendal, which was closer to the main road. While Tiet made the eight hour round trip back to Cape Town, we did some maintenance on our tracks and set up camp for the night. Well, on our second landing today, I had inspected our prop and a little big chunk was missing out of it. This must have picked up a, a big stone. Um, but thank goodness we had some Prattley's putty and we, uh, we've just uh, mended it. And we'll see over the next couple of days how it holds out. I think I found some corn here. You tell they're ready by peeling, looking for these little brown magotis. And then you peel it back a bit and you check those yellow, delicious corn. And you grab it. You stick it in your pocket. You don't tell the farmer. I didn't get that that I was after. But it's so nice to have Mr. Bean back here in one piece with his passport. 